morning, everyone. It's been a pretty busy morning. We had a lot going on, a lot of new members with the challenge group, which is really exciting. I'm so happy people are jumping on this bandwagon and uh, taking advantage of 21 Day Fix, which is a great program, and just really embracing the hi, honey, nutrition and fitness. And um, I uh, got up this morning and was trying to figure. Got up a little bit late, so I had to figure out how I was going to incorporate uh, my workout this morning because usually I get up before the kids but I let myself sleep in this morning so uh, um, it, rather than just not doing it at all I you know made the kids we had waffles this morning well they had waffles so I made them waffles and then did the stuff that I needed to do on Facebook and then you know threw laundry in did 25 minute um, T25 and then threw another load of laundry in and did another T25 so to, tr to try to incorporate it and now I'm going to go upstairs and fold the laundry that was done so you, just to show you that you can like incorporate you know getting stuff done in the house with, with doing your workout um, rather than sitting on the couch or while the laundry is being done or you know sitting on Facebook or your, your, your phone uh, you can uh, get that 25 minute workout in, which is really great that it's 25 minutes or the 30 minute 21 day fix because they, they're so quick. You're not spending an hour, an hour and a half, you have to go to the gym, come back. So that's what's really great about these beach body programs. Um, they're so convenient. Uh, and that's why I love them. <laughs> and I don't have to leave the house and I can stay with my little ones. Um, another thing I wanted to, to touch on was, um, there was I posted something the other day about this, um, that muffin top video, which I don't even like calling it the muffin top video because I just think that that's ridiculous. And um, I wasn't trying to offend anybody. I just, to me, and everyone has their own personal views about it, but to me, you know, celebrating that or, you know, that the woman making fun of herself to me just wasn't um, powerful for women. It was kind of like just accepting not trying to do anything positive for yourself um, and and to me that's that's just not okay it's it's giving in to defeat it's I'm not saying that if you know that if you're healthy then that's okay but to me that that's not healthy actually having large amounts of fat in that area of your body is one of the leading causes for heart disease and stroke for women so I don't think that that's okay and that's what I was trying to say by putting it there you know that we shouldn't celebrate things like that I think strength and wellness in women is beautiful. I think strong women are beautiful. I don't think skinny, rail thin women are beautiful. Strength in anyone is is attractive. Um, strength in your brain, strength in your body, strength in your soul. And I just thought that that was a negative connotation for women and a negative image. And that's what I meant by that. So if anyone was offended in our group, I apologize. But what I was trying to say was that I didn't think that woman was promoting a good self image for women either, whether it's a skinny model on the runway or something like that. Um, I don't think that it's positive for women. So um, I hope everyone has a wonderful Saturday. Again, I feel like I say this all the time, get ready for the snow. Uh, get your healthy foods in stock in case uh, we are stuck in the house for a couple of days, but at least you'll be able to work out because you don't have to go to the gym. You have your DVDs. And um, check in with your accountability partners. And please, um, I asked you to do a couple of things on the post, so please do them because I do want to know where everybody is in their programs, uh, what week you're on, and uh, just so that I can keep track of everybody. Uh, we have so many people in the group right now and rather than dividing everybody, I just felt like let's just keep it going for right now. But I'd like to know where everybody is um, so I can stay updated and, and touch base with all of you. Some of you I feel like I haven't heard from in a while and I'd, I'd like to know where you are because if you're having problems, that's what we're here for. Okay, so have a great day and uh, I will talk to everybody probably tomorrow. Have a great day, bye.